this is the Honda CRV 2018. Now, this car is very, very nice, and basically, I'm going to be reviewing this car. Oh boy, this is gonna be a fun one. Should you put your family in it? In it? That is the question. So you have to start in the front of this car and just show how good it is. It's pretty nice in this car, and um, yeah, it's, it's a Honda what you expect. Now this car actually has a feature where you can actually press this button and it'll and it'll set into the mode where you'll stay in the lanes no matter what. It'll start beeping at you if you get out of the lanes, which is pretty cool. Nice job, Honda. Also, for even more safety, there's a thing where you basically you can have a you can have the cruise control, but Mother hates it because you would always slam into the person in front of you. Now this one, it'll beep at you or stop itself. Probably not. So basically, so here is the, here's the touch screen. Works very well. Works pretty well. Go device connected. I'm already here. So, there is settings. Yeah, now look at this. So you can... Hi. It's so pretty, the lights in the back. So... That's my cell phone. You can here. have your cell phone and there's a navigation thing. Wow. Yeah, that's, that's the... My it's cell basically phone the now. same thing as the Garmin. This. So you can have... You can have this thing have your... um. You can have... All your thing. No, uh, no, 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 no. I don't want copyright. Uh, please, why? I don't want copyright, please. Okay. So, okay. So this thing right here is the backup camera of the Honda CRV. Now, now look at this. Now look at the. I'm sorry. Go ahead. Now look at the really cool part. Here's the. There's different views for the bottom. So if you're in the lane or not because some people have a lot of problems with parking. There's this mode, use... which is the small mode, or you can use the full 360 view, which is pretty big. Yeah. Not gonna this lie. would be used like if you're backing right you can, up to yeah, something. Yeah, it's really used for backing up into small parking spaces. So, did you see that? It'll that beep at da -da 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 -da. That's because there was a car It'll coming. beep at you if there's a car coming so even more safety in that part so you can even turn your gps's off so basically basically this thing is pretty pretty really quiet it's really quiet and the thing is um basically the thing is that you can just relax in this car and it's really really quiet in here so, um, you never have to worry about the noises that come from the car because there's no noises that come from the car. So, there's wood here. This is, that's real. No, it's not real wood. Uh, they don't put real wood in the cars anymore. Eh, uh, that kind of sucks. Well, in luxury cars they do. No, they don't. They do. No, they don't. Why the heck would you not put wood in a luxury, why the heck would you not put real wood in a luxury car. I don't know, but I was told that they do not use it in any car. Anymore. That's a lie! The dumbest thing I've ever heard. So basically, here's just some, is the driving experience. And, um, yeah. And also, if you can see right there, there are settings for the seats, so they can go whatever. The passenger seat doesn't have very much. Just, well, look at this. Just four when back. Normally, when you come up to a stoplight, you have to keep your foot on the brake while you're sitting at the stoplight, or the yep. car will roll forward. You'll have to, but this one you can do brake hold, mm -hmm. and it'll hold the brake until. Now it's holding. Now holding it's holding the brake, and as soon as you accelerate, the brake goes off. I don't like brake hold on myself, but that's. Uh, that's kind of a neat feature. I just don't like it when I'm driving. Yeah. I'm too old. <laughs> so, 
basically all you need to do is just do that if you just don't want to really just hold the brake forever and then like you get a weak start and then people are like honking at you because like you're like taking too long and you're forgetting that you have to like take off the brake so it's pretty good yeah. chumps on a hyundai tucson but you got old crv nothing on us get out of our way civic yeah. that's the car that we were on we were in when we were on vacation the dodge grand caravan and that thing just felt like a big boat. It was nice to drive though. It was really nice. Everything was really relaxed and nice. And I think this well, uh, this car does an even better job of being that nice. So um, if you go into um, what is it? Uh, Apple CarPlay, I think. Yeah. What are you trying to do? There we go. So this is where you'll find all the things like that and. Can press that and it'll act like your normal it'll act like your normal thing your phone so i think it can go into honda and then it goes all no honda it can just go back. Uh, that tells you when you have the oil it change. just goes back to like everything there's info there's settings there's phone um there's audio for copyrighted music <laughs> um but the whole touch screen thing is actually pretty good I'm gonna try and tap around with the touchscreen and see how fast I can touch around. Want to try to call mommy? There we go. So it's this fast. What? It's that fast that it can't lag and it can't really do anything oh, else. Want to try to call mommy? Sure. Oh no. Kathy De Haven on cell. Calling Kathy De Haven. Mm. Wow. Oh, it worked. <laughs> oh my gosh. It actually worked. Oh, please don't. Please don't show up with phone number. Please no. Hello. Hi. Um, I'm driving around in the new CRV and I'm also doing a review. So, you're on, uh, you're on. You're on my review. I'm on your review? Yes. yes. Okay, I think I'm gonna add call. Okay, uh, no, wait, don't do that. Oh, I see. It's the fact that it calls. Yeah. yeah. I am home now. Why don't you guys get home so we can have dinner? Okay, we're coming home now. Yeah. Okay, so, I'm pulling in the garage with the old car. Bye. Okay, bye. So uh, that was the uh, call feature. So uh, yeah, that was the um, that was the entire review of the thing. Oh, that's really strong. There we go. That was the entire review. So, bop. So um, that was the entire review. Now, at the end of all of Kelly Blue Book's videos, there's usually a thing where they rate a car. Yes. Now, basically, I think I'm going to rate this car a... 10? I, I don't know, because there was a problem with... There's a problem with nothing. The, the, the This thing compared to this thing, in, I'm going to call it a 10 out of 10, because it's really good. I don't so, think I really need it. Bye.